Nice. Weather didn't catch up yet. I mean, the water hasn't caught up yet. No, I don't know what that is. It's cold. That's what it is. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna cut you oh off. Oh my gosh! All right, All right guys. See you guys later. Thank you guys for tuning in. So I just 
got a couple of shrimp this way because they were on sale. And I thought these are really nice sh shrimp. And these are the red shrimp. So we got like, I think four, no, five of these. And then right here, I have some mussels that I have to clean. I'm gonna sit them in this water in the sink. You know you got to clean all that stuff out of there, right? And they are alive, so I'm going to put them in this water. Rinse that mess off. All right. It smells like seafood in my kitchen. Don't start that. Blinking off now. They said they fixed y'all. I don't know what's wrong with service though. Never had that issue. Sorry about that, guys. But yeah, so we got some crab meat right here. We got some red shrimp right there. I have some corn over here. I'll take you guys over there in a second. Bless you guys. Baby been sneezing since we got the last shot, y'all. The last poke round this poke shot. So we got this crab meat, right? And this is the claw meat. I don't know if y'all know about that, but I'm gonna prepare that for you guys as well. Then right here, what is this? Oh, this is one lobster. I have lobster, but it's frozen. All right, so we got this one lobster tail, right? We're going to put that over here, too, because we got to clean that, too, right? All right. We're going to get it popping. Popping. All right. So we got some shrimp right here. Oh, watch out there now. I tried to get everything that, everything from the sea for the day that I could. So I got some can I drop that? I got these snow crab. I got one because baby don't eat a lot of those. Then I got this dungeon and crab. He gave me two. That was real nice down at that fish market. He said he was going to be looking at me today. I'm like, okay. Said he subscribed too. I was like, oh, I need to know your name. <laughs> so I can say, hey, give you a shout out. All right, so we got a dungeon. And we got the uh, the snow crab, cluster, and legs, right? Oh yeah, we gotta wash that off. So look, that baby gave me a snapper. I got the head and the bones. So I'm gonna leave that because that's gonna be for another day. Put that in the freezer. Make me some shrimp or some type of broth with that fish stew, some seafood, or something. I'm going to get down with that because I know I like the... Hi, Auntie! There you go. Alright, so I can start now because the people I love are on here. No, I'm not saying you guys, but my daddy and my auntie's on live. Alright, so I'm going to go over this one more time, right? So I have some crab meat. There you go. I have some crab meat in here. I am making a seafood sauce. I have five red shrimp. I have the crab meat that actually come out the snow crabs right here. I bought a red snapper and had them to fillet it. And we're gonna stuff this guys and bake that. So we got the red snapper nice and clean. We have the Dungeness crab legs and we have the snow crab we have one lobster tail right here I have some mussels that I'm going to clean and some shrimp alright so we got all the owl stuff right here oh yeah we about to get down up in this joint I have 
some fresh spinach that I'm going to make as well. Yeah! Alright. I got our breadcrumbs for our crab cake. We're going to make two of those and then we're going to stuff it. Stuff this uh, red snapper. Alright, so I'm going to take y'all on over here now. So, I have some shrimp right here that I'm actually going to put in our crab cake. Alright? We gonna, are we going to rock y'all? Maryland, and I 
miss my daddy. So, with that being said, my husband is here. He's daddy. He's my husband and kid's father. So, I wanted to do something special. Y'all know I'm going to cook anyway. You know I'm going to cook anyway for it. You know? So, I decided, shoot, you might as well do seafood. Y'all know I've been talking about that. But. So, I went to the store, right? You know your girl went to the store. Searching, searching, searching. I think we're out probably three hours. Because everybody's probably thinking the same thing, y'all. The same thing. They are. They were. But, um... I decided to go and look for seafood. I'm going to wait for a while. I know you guys are probably out. Some people already had reservations and stuff. But shoot. Go back and look at this video. Or chime in with me. Alright, so of course you know we're doing some seafood as I said before. right and I'm just cleaning them cleaning them and then I'm gonna unpack everything that I purchased from the store and I just really want it because we're gonna go out earlier but I know it's gonna be crowded if there's no not really food in the tank so we know this place is crowded and we thought it was going to rain today so um, I was saying well maybe we should stay in hey we should stay in right but guess what y'all it didn't even rain I like ain't that something so I'm just getting a little organized here waiting for my daddy to chime in I would like to tell my daddy something. You know they say you tell people how you feel and that you love them while they're here. And to me growing up, my dad was my hero. My soldier. To this day, y'all, he's still working. He's always been a nice provider. I'm going to wait until he get on here because I called him and told him, Dad, I need you to... Uh, Get on Facebook Live. So maybe a second it was a little longer. Y'all know how they don't like the new stuff. But hopefully Auntie I let him know she'll get him on there. Are you there? Yeah, she'll get him on there. So happy Father's Day to everyone. To everyone who's a father. No matter if you're had children or you raised children. Thank God for you guys. Going through this Black Lives Matters and having grown kids and you know children or raising boys are a really hard time. A really kind of difficult. So but that being said, thank you guys. Hey, it's a daddy now, y'all. <laughs> I'm gonna tell my son to call him. Maybe he's trying to get on there. But I am doing today's smooth is doing um seafood, guys. I am doing seafood, so you know your girl went all out for baby. And I wish my dad was here, but. When I go see him, he gonna have whatever he wants. I miss my daddy. I am a daddy's girl. Alright, so I bought a can of um, crab meat, right? <clears throat> Hold on one second. Let me ask my son to call my, my father. Hold on.
never had too much. Uh oh, it's off the leg. So we got these muscles here. And we're gonna do the bag method today, right? We're gonna do that bag method, which is the crab boiling, right? We're gonna do that stove top. because we have all this good technology here so you still can keep in contact without seeing your family but I'll be there soon and my Uncle James he's a dad too shout out to Uncle James and my Uncle George happy Father's Day with that being said daddy I wanted to bring you on live to tell you how much I love you how much I miss you how much I appreciate you and um People don't really get a chance to say these things. And I don't think I've ever told my dad. Oh, we always tell each other we love each other and stuff like that. But today is a special day for me because my dad's here. Um, he's always been one of my number one supporters. Um, but, Daddy, I have something for you. And, you know, some cards don't reflect on how you really feel. 
So that's why I decided to do this to do this card for you dad and also to tell you and this is for my dad guys so that I have three cameras up so this says dad you're always you've always been my hero and for those who don't know that my dad's uh, military he's out one of our soldiers and I think my uncle's uncle's work as well but daddy this says you never set um you never set out to be a hero dad but that's why you are that's what you are to me oh shoot i messed up i'm gonna get my cousin on here i'm gonna start over okay so it says dad you always be my hero you never set set out to be my hero to be a hero dad but that's what you are to me i, I admit i admire you and admire who you are, what you stand for, and how you live life. With integrity and strength and love. I couldn't ask for a better father or more or a role model than the one I have I have in you. Love you always. We'll always adore you. You are my heart, my soldier, and my backbone. I love you, Daddy, and happy Father's Day. Love you, Daddy. So today, guys, I know my dad loves seafood, but I just wanted him to see me alive. Hi, Auntie. Hi, James. Hey, Carrie. All family, guys. And I just thought that would be so special. My dad is not really sentimental, but I know he appreciates this. And I want you guys, Daddy's a kid. This is what I'll be making for my dad. I'm making this for my husband as well. So my son and I went out and got seafood, guys. So Daddy, when you come here, I'm going, boy, you gonna have some fun. So guys, we are doing the the uh, bag, the uh, royal bag on top stove, right? So I have water in here, and we just gonna put this in here like that. And I'm gonna turn the stove on low now. Let me turn these cameras back around. All right, guys, you can see the GoPro. He rocking. He rocking. I love this little thing. All right, so, guys, we're going to put our, <clears throat> our um, seafood bag in here inside of the bag, right? And mind you, we're going to use this as a steam room. So, I am going to make some. Wait a minute. I am going to make some sauce right quick, and that's the pour in here in our thingy. Mm. All right, guys, so I'm going to use this pan right here, right? And y'all know, ain't nothing wrong with a little butter. All right. Oh, we're going to add this whole... I got enough pot. I thought. That's what I put down right there for that. All right. So, we're going to make our sauce, right? So, we're going to use two of these. And butter and put in here. And you can just put the, um, put your out on low, right? Because you don't want to, excuse me, you don't want to burn the butter. <clears throat> we're going to add some of this garlic. Actually, we're going to add all of this garlic. Right? So I'm gonna make this sauce and you guys can make it as well. It's really, really good. And this was just from off the top of my head and I just stuck with it. So when we do eat crab oil and I make it from scratch, this is the sauce we use. Really good. All right, so look, I made some today's mood seafood season. And if you would like to taste this, this will be for sale soon. 
and I'll be selling today's mood. I have three um, rubs that I'll be selling. Two. And I'll put a video out for that, guys. But I gotta see if this spicy. Okay, I was gonna say that's a spicy one. Okay. <laughs> I gotta be careful. All right, so we're gonna put some basil. And you never can have so much basil. You guys, you can add, slap your mama for a little kick to that. And some obey. But I'm adding this. Y'all don't have this, you need to go get some. It's good on your fish, it's good on your chicken, it's good on your shrimp, and it gives a little. I eat guacamole toast. I put this on it. It's so good. Alright. We're going to add just a little bit of our Obey. It wouldn't be seafood sauce if we didn't have Obey. Alright. So now, I know y'all going to say, look at all these seasons. We're going to add some adobo. Some adobo. I'm looking for paprika. All right. We're going to add some paprika in here. And this is smoked pe paprika, guys. Yep, that's smoked paprika. We're going to add some of this Himalayan pink. Add some of this Italian. Bam! anymore so I don't use this as much but you can add that that gives a really really nice flavor and I'm gonna add one of my bouillon cubes right and that's for flavor Enough garlic and it smells so good. You want that? You know, that just bomb. Alright. So we're gonna kind of just let this mix in here, and I'm gonna show you guys how it looks. Alright. So you want it kind of not really loose. I'm gonna add some EVOO to this as well. And this is our sauce, guys. Alright. Y'all still here with me? Alright. Alright, YouTube. This is our seafood sauce. 